Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is part 15 of SQL Server tutorial. In today's session, we are going to discuss about statements in SQL Server. Before continuing with this session, I would request you all, please subscribe to my channel and click on bell icon for notification alerts. SQL statements are nothing but identifiers, parameters, variables, names, data types and SQL reserve words which are using in the SQL Server as called as statements. First, we'll see what are all the types of statements available in SQL Server. The SQL statements are separated as some groups that is called DDL, DQL, DML, DCL and TCL. DDL is nothing but data definition language, DQL is data query language, data manipulation language, data control language and transaction control language. Also these groups are called as sub languages of SQL Server. SQL is structured query language. Also we will call all these groups as sub languages of SQL Server. So under each category we have different types of statements. So under data definition language we have some statements like create, alter, drop, rename, truncate and comment. Under data query language, we have only single statement that is select statement. Under data manipulation language, we have insert update and delete. Under DCL data control language, we have grant and revoke. Under transaction control language, we have begin trend, commit trend and rollback. We have different set of statements under each category. We are going to discuss about each statement with the examples. SQL Server. That's it for today. In next session, we are going to discuss about data definition language. Under data definition language, we have statements like create, alter, drop, rename, truncate and comment statements. We are going to discuss about each statement with the examples. That's it for today. Thanks for watching.